Keyframes in Kafka Total Force feature that allow you to create smooth animation and effects within your values. There are specific points in the timeline which can set parameters for elements like position, scale, rotation, and opacity. Now, how to actually use the keyframe? And I'm disturbing with the theory. Now, first, I have opened my cap cut as you can see and maximize this. And I have a channel over in the background here. You can see I will first thing is that import the background in the main track. Now, I will import the here, drag out this channel logo also. And now I want that my channel logo comes from the top and uh, stop there uh, three seconds in the middle and then go again to the corner uh, and uh, but the, I, I want that these changes occur smoothly we can do this using the keyframes now the first thing is I will drag this to the my channel logo here and a little bit I will scale this I mean zoom it out this and now I will drag this to the top upper and I, I want that this logo comes from the top and stop at the middle for two to three seconds now the first how to add keyframes to adding uh, keyframes you have to go to the value and basic here you can see the position you can add keyframes on all or you can add keyframes on the scale or uh, position or rotate one by one now i will add the keyframes i mean the first i will add uh, on the position because i want to drag this to the middle and now i want uh, you have to add another keyframes here and you can Click on the keyframes on adding or by just drag this out and what changes you occur keyframes will be automatically added. I go to the position and why I will make it uh, I mean 500 and this will goes a little bit here you can see. Now I will drag this to the middle and I will a little bit zoom this zoom in this. And you can see, I'll show you the preview for this. And you can see this is, you can also, uh, for, I mean, use the glitch, or you can also, uh, for the second keyframe from first one, uh, in order to slow uh, this animation. Now I want this to be stop uh, three seconds in the middle, or two seconds, or one second, whatever you want, and then go to the corner with the in zooming out. How can we do this? We can do this by adding another keyframes here. I'll add another keyframe. And I will add whatever keyframes you want. And we're all. And now at this point, I will add another keyframes. Or there is no need of keyframe. You can uh, do like, I will zoom it out. And go to the, I um, mean, drag this to the corner. Now the keyframe, as you can see, automatically added. Now I'll show you the free view of this. And yeah, here you can see that score. That's how you can add uh, animation. You can also uh, do like I will uh, go to the. You can also uh, rotate this. Uh, I mean, this logo uh, here uh, for the rotation. I will uh, cancel this. I'll go to the second frame after that I will add here uh, another keyframe I mean I mean another keyframe here but first I will remove this from here this keyframe and now I will add the rotate key. I mean I will rotate this and the keyframe will be added automatically and here you can see now this will be, I mean, uh, rotating, I will play this and here you can see it's rotated but now after this rotation I will, I mean drag it to the corner again, small this and drag it to the corner, 
and this animation will be amazing i will show you the view this is the power of the keyframes here you can see and there we go it's good i will show you the view again and this is good this is awesome you can do this in your projects i hope you will have understand the concept of keyframe how to use the keyframes in CapCut. i hope this will really help you and if you have enjoyed the video press the like button also press the subscribe button i have a bunch of quotes in my channel you can check out this and if you have not subscribed to my channel this is my strictly i mean i am strictly saying the channel, subscribe to my channel otherwise you will be i mean i don't know subscribe to my channel Thanks for watching the video.